Greetings everyone, and today is the day I will finally discuss about the whole news of Hope, the Isles new video that they have posted. It goes over the map Hope and many different other things that will be shown. Basically a project where new dinos are being added, certain dinos are being re reworked on, then again all of them are, and many new aspects. The day and night cycle basically goes over the atmosphere of how day then shifts to night. It is a wonderful aspect, considering it is completely changed, unlike the old version, which I shall now call it, with the night between Dinyo and the V3 map. It looks a lot more realistic. I can't wait to play this. Then, the redevelopment with the part of the coastal zone. I love how the feet between the big and the small are different, considering the bigger feet are a lot deeper in the sand. Especially the water looks a lot more realistic than it has. I love how there are a little bit of rocks, even the palm trees, and certain things flying over the island as well. It looks like seagulls. In my opinion, it, it doesn't look like any dinosaurs that I'm seeing. Either way, I love how there are also grass as well. Even the rocks look a lot more, well, <laughs> realistic. I like how the arch between, it looks like a bridge. I wonder if you can walk over that. I can't wait to go over it. Then, the grassland zone. I love how that looks a lot more realistic. There are even different plants, too. But then it shifts over to the stegos. That is what I find cool. Considering, at one point, I noticed there's another creature hiding in the bushes. Which I find really interesting. But then it goes to showing the stego grazing. I wonder if that's going to be in certain areas, or widely spread, or just in the grasslands, but we shall see. It, I mean, grassland. <laughs> then, the jungle. Oh my goodness, I love how this looks. It looks a lot more realistic between the shadows and the light. Especially with how the sun is sort of... I'm gonna say it in a, and I guess a stupidly way, reflective. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but then I noticed there's even a little creature there too. I don't know if it's a dryo. To me, I just think it might be one of the new creatures. But I even love how there's some water over there too. It looks so much better. I love how there are new plants. Then. It comes to the waterfall, to where you get to see the bracky in the distance, because I sort of see that hump. But then it comes towards the water, and then I see the fish, and then I completely lose it because, oh my goodness, I have been wanting fishing in this game. I wonder how that's going to work. I'm guessing it's going to be in certain amounts of water, like near waterfalls. But I wish we had also seen where the if the Suko was gonna grab it with either its mouth or its claws. It seems like it's gonna grab it with its claws though. It's like I'm slowly thinking about it. Oh my goodness, and then the Dinosuchus. Or Dinosuchus. Whatever you call it, I don't care. It's a it's an alligator thing. Correct me if I'm wrong again. I even love how it slaps the uh the camera but I love how the angle towards it I've seen so much of it but I can't wait to see the, the dinosuchus whatever you call it dinosuchus um, between the f Rex and 
you know. I can't wait to see that fight. I'm excited. Then the growth system. I love how this works. I love how the horns slowly grow out. I love every single thing about it. Hey, my favorite color is orange. Darn it, the aisle, you know my weakness. <laughs> but it looks so majestic. I even love how the parasaur grows. I love how you slowly see the horn, I guess, horn bit, whatever you call it. I love how that part slowly grows. Now, between the male and the female, the only thing I have to say that I love is that I love how it looks like there are stripes. It looks so beautiful, so amazing. I even notice how the babies are literally laying on the nest. Finally. Finally, collision. Oh my goodness, I don't know whether this is compies, it looks like compies. But I also notice that that is basically a trike skull. So a trike died there. How did it die? But I will never know. But then comes the thing I have been waiting for. The one and almighty Spinosaurus. That looks almost like a hypo spino. It sort of has the traits. But oh my goodness. It looks majestic. It looks a lot different than the Hypospino. But I love it. So, in conclusion, I am so hyped to play more of the aisle. Once when it comes out, you will be seeing more videos. I'm sorry I basically missed it. But don't you worry. But then, there's something else. Carnage comes home. I know that's probably Primal Carnage or Primal Carnage Extinction. I have Primal Carnage Extinction. I am excited. And now, I will say without a doubt, I hope y'all enjoyed. See ya!